Hatlip. Okay, so we're going to take a look at the uh, cat leap now, basically. That's uh, a move when you're jumping from one object to another, and you're going to say, for example, if the other object is, is higher, or for example, sometimes you can do level cat leaps. Uh, we're going to demonstrate a couple to you in a minute anyway. Um, but I'm going to break it down into some key points for you, and then show you the demos, and we'll go from there. So to start off, basically, you want a nice, uh, nice steady takeoff. And basically, the drive, a lot of the drive, obviously, is going to come from your legs and a lot from your arms and your shoulders because you want a good bend, a good flex in your legs. And as you, as you look to push off and you look to jump, you really drive those arms and use those shoulders to give you more energy and more power to get the distance to where you need to land, yeah? So your start off is obviously on the edge of your first takeoff point. As you bend down, you bring your arms back, you bend and you flex at your legs. And as you're going to take off, you push off your toes, push your, through your arms, through your shoulders, push everything forward towards where you're going to land, like the precision jump. But then obviously you need to think about what you're doing in the air towards your landing. At that point, the second phase, when you're in the air, you've jumped and you've taken off. So you're, you're in the air and you need to start thinking about the landing. So the key point here is you don't want to leave your feet behind you and you don't want them too far in front because obviously if they're behind you, you're just going to hit the wall with your hands and then your stomach. And alternatively, if they're too far in front of you, you won't be able to get your hands to it. So you really need to get that balance as you're in the air to bring your hips uh, level and your feet want to hit the wall ever so slightly, ideally ever so slightly just before your hands meet it. So that's your landing basically. Try and get a good grip with your hands right on the ledge, right on the lip, land, flex at your arms, flex at your legs, bend and take that impact, and then you can look to push up and, uh, and continue on your way. So let's have a look at some of those uh, demonstrations now, yeah?